Welcome back, survivors. I'm the Survival Vis, and we return Project Zomboid, where it's turning into Project Campoid, because last episode we got the last of the gear moved out to the lake here that we're probably going to try to set up a little base beside. Uh, that way, too, if I set up here, I can do little expeditions into town to find stuff and then just retreat back out here where there might not be any zombies to worry about. But yeah, my stages right now is trying to figure out... Um, exactly, like, how I can go about doing some things. It's like, if I look at, uh, crafting... Oh, I can make sturdy sticks. You know what? Yeah, let me craft that, because I do need some of those for... Okay, okay, so that gave me eight sturdy sticks. I need those for... Crafting a tent kit. Uh, where is that tent kit? I think it's under survivalist. Campfire kit. Yeah, here we go. So I just need four stakes now. And those, I think I can actually... Yeah, I just need tree branches. So if I can just look around, I might be able to even find those somewhere on the ground. Yes. Uh, like, over here, I don't know if that's just, like, decoration, or that's actual things I can pick up and... No, see, okay, that might just be decoration. You know what? At least one thing I do know to get, uh... Trees down, is I have the hand axe, so I might as well... see if I can get anything else taken down and get some more resources coming in. Because I've got the tarp, I've now got the sticks. Okay, there we go. Okay, there's one tree branch there. Okay, yeah, I'm also getting really tired, too. I don't know if I'll actually be able to sleep in the tent without anything, or the tent will act as, like, a miniature indoor space. I do kind of wish I was getting more than a single tree branch per tree. Oh, speaking of... Okay, yeah, let me grab those tree branches. I think... I might even have another tree branch in the fire that I haven't started using yet, so I could probably snag that out of there. Okay. Let me see. Yeah, let me craft all of those. Okay, now, if I go into crafting again... It says I still need one more stake. Or maybe it's kind of got, like, consumed into the campfires I tossed it in there or something. Like, I've got a crafted spear there. Okay, let me see if I can take down one more tree. To get this last branch I'll need. should also mind my health. It's has a slight damage, but I think that's mostly because of, yeah, just how hard I've been working here. There we go. 
Oh, not even a tree branch there. Come on. Okay, what happens if I have, like... Oh, okay, so that's what investigation mode kind of does. It limits down my field of view, but it gives me more indication to... Like, things I'm finding. Yeah, okay, so it looks like I did lose out on... Everything there. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Let me just sit on the ground for a moment. I'll just have a bit of pop, just something to drink and rest. And then I'll try taking down one more tree. Just because I... It shouldn't be that hard to find another tree branch, right? Yeah, body's health is doing okay. I know the tired is going to be hitting very hard soon. Oh, come on. Don't oh, hang on a moment. Okay, termites. Like, there's no tree branches just falling on the ground around all the... Oh, hang on a moment. Ah, oh, mushrooms. I was really hoping just to find a tree branch sitting on the ground somewhere. Stones. Uh, I'm just going to walk back towards that uh, one house we've been staying at. Just because I am getting pretty encumbered, so... That, and I can also, uh, clean up the bandage I've got, too. Yeah, for all the trees in here, and it looks like there are some things on the ground. Like, can I do anything about this log here? No, I think that's just... Eh, that's just what it is. Is that a sponge on there? Uh, yeah, just a... Okay. Let's just wash the clothing off. Not that I think anything's all that dirty. Oh, uh, maybe our pants got a bit of blood on them. Now I'll get a drink in. Close the curtains, just that way we don't have anybody able to see through it. And let's get some sleep in. We'll probably head out back to the lake in the middle of the night, but... At least this way we're going to be well rested to keep working. Uh, you know what, I was thinking about maybe trying to, like, grab stuff to make that mattress, but... Let me first see what the tent actually offers with it. I 
Because again, I don't know if the tent will just act as like a little mini indoor area that I could like stay in and be sheltered. Or it'll actually offer me like a way to sleep. Again, I don't want to go into the games knowing too much about them. I prefer having these blind approaches as completely fresh and new. So if anybody is trying to join or is interested in the games and like says, ah, well, let's check out a series on this before I pick it up. What's it like? What is it like as a completely new player? Is somebody else going through it? Because I feel like if you do know a little bit too much at times, it can kind of, you overstep and you forget things that a new player would be completely oblivious to. But here we are, we're back here. I also should check... Yeah, the only way is to make them from tree branches, and I don't think there's any way to, like, actually... Uh, break down a log to get tree branches. That was the axe that broke, wasn't it? Son of a bitch. Uh, I don't know if I have that much to be able to, like, uh... Yeah, see, I don't have a lot here that I could actually use to repair this. Damn it. Okay, well, I do have... I could try making a stone axe, which is... A tree branch. Except I cannot find tree branches because they don't... Has firewood, food, and animals are all kind of common here, but. Now let me disable this so that way. I was gonna say so we can actually see, but truth be told, I can't see much. I can barely see my character, so this is probably just gonna be a black screen for you guys. Let me go back looking around some of the houses and try to figure out how I can change things up. So yeah, losing that hand axe sucks already. There's got to be a way to find, like, I don't know, can I even, like, no, see, I don't see. Okay, yeah, so, like, I can make log walls and that, which I'll probably do around our area. That's just, I was hoping I could, like, right-click and examine a tree or search the ground and find things like that easily. And I guess I'm just going to go roaming around the houses a little bit, see what else I can find. Ah, uh, there is... How far off is the storage units? Okay. That one, there were some boxes that I didn't quite get to check because they were behind some other stuff. I didn't know how to move things around. But I could even see maybe about just trying to, like, grab a crate. And bring it where I want to, or need to. Uh, no, I'm gonna see about equipping those military boots. I might even have... Okay, I had a pair on, so it doesn't really matter which I did. Let me see, if I equip that secondary... Uh, we'll take the box of screws, but we'll leave the toolbox here. Yeah, it's a little hard to see in the dark here. Yeah, I'm just looking around to see if I can find... Maybe my carpentry book, or... Things like that help us. Oh, there is actually a hand torch. Now, how would I have that, like... 
turned on or used. Okay, I guess I have it actually turned on right now. See, it didn't look like there's anything in that place. Uh, do, do, do. I'm trying. Let me check the map again. Yeah, losing that hand axe is really, really unfortunate. Especially, I was one thing away from having the last tree branch I needed too. And it sucks that you actually need a tree branch to make an axe, but you need an axe to get a tree branch. I don't know if there's some way I could even, like, try breaking down a tree. I was like, I've got... Uh... Yeah, see, there's nothing I can really interact with that with. I don't... Let me... Yeah, turn that on so I've got a little bit of... I heard something strange there. I'm not seeing anything, though. Ah, uh, some miscellaneous books. There's mechanics, but I don't really need that. I might as well just have those pickles. They didn't say they were fresh, but they didn't say they were rotten either. Man, nothing really here. Yeah, might as well go investigate just some of these places again, looking around. I don't really know what my next step is with the, uh... What is all this here? Oh, this is old. These are the firearms and everything I had left behind. I was trying to figure out, like, what is all this on the ground? But that's all just bullets and ammunition. Yeah, I still... Uh, you know what? I might as well pack these with me. They are canned things. They should last for a good while. Oh, hang on, there was shelves here. Oh, nothing good. Eh, just the washroom. Like, I tried... Oh, hang on, this... Oh. More stones. I guess I can go down to that little cabin I had found here. Oh, what's this? Grass or something. Oh, rosemary. Like, I'm able to find stuff like that, but I can't find just a simple tree branch falling on the ground somewhere. Oh, hello. That's a lot of canned stuff, so you know what? Uh, no, I'll leave the dog food on. I have some better standards to pick from right now. We're not that desperate. And there is one more building south of here. Or I guess this is technically the west? Or, no, maybe it is south. I'm trying to remember. The map that you open up with M is a little bit skewed from how it actually is. Okay, just that looks like a couple of trailers, but I don't see anybody around here. I 
don't know if I've been around here. There are just, like, no zombies here. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm going to get the hell out of here, because I know there's going to be zombies somewhere nearby are just going to be completely drawn to that. Uh, maybe that'll help as a distraction for getting them out of areas I might look into later. But, yeah, I'm trying to figure out what I can do next. I can do things like remove grass or pick up some small things, but I'm not having any luck with tree branches. Although, I wonder, because I have the saws back at our camp, maybe I should try equipping one of those and see if maybe that'll let me take down some trees. Eh, we'll make a return trip to where we got our campsite sort of coming together. You know what? Let me just see about having... We'll open that up and then have it. There we go. Might as well open that box of screws, too. If that's just me making the sound, but I thought I heard something else rustling out here, too. Okay, well, at least here's the path, so we made it back to where we got everything all set out. But yeah, just, ah, this one tree branch shy. Let me see, equip that in our primary. See if I can use that to take down a tree. No. I mean, I can try making log walls, but I feel like I should wait until I, I actually have myself. That is where that last stake was. It was in the toolbox. Okay, well, at least we're going to be able to put down a tent now. Okay, so that will act as like a place I can sleep. So I still could use a container out here to actually store all this crap in. I should see about trying to make a log wall too. Although I feel like the log wall... It might just be that's only going to take up one tile and I'll need a lot of... Yeah, that is exactly how it works. So at least what I could do is try working and building up a wall and a little bit of base here. 
what do I need for... Alright, that was under carpentry, right? Yeah, wall, log wall. A lot of ripped sheets. Logs, I mean, I will have to try to... Figure out what I can do in regards to... Oh, hang on, where is... I thought I had the axe on hand. Or the saw on hand. Yeah, I do. But that's... Oh, if I have logs, I can transfer, create planks out of them. Okay, well, that's at least handy to know now. I wish I knew it a bit sooner, but... Okay, so that's how I can get more planks to make stuff. So the good news is we've at least got a uh, place to sleep. We've got a campfire. I've got plenty of things to hold water. And I'll just be trying to sort this out and figure out, like, more I can do. For now, though, let me switch off the flashlight so we're not wasting its battery. Yeah, I'll try and get just a wall, like a small square around this little area here. But the biggest thing will be figuring out what tools will help me where. Right now, if I can get a tree branch, I can make a new axe because I found stones. But... Yeah, the only thing I can... It's not really letting me know... Like, there's twigs, there's some kind of wild edible. Cilantro. Maybe I just should go, like... Oh. Okay, that's twigs, too. So maybe I can just hopefully wander around the woods and I'll find a tree branch on the ground. I don't know how lucky I'll be. You know, I should have my nightstick ready just in case. Oh, something. Ah, uh, more twigs. Yeah, I don't know how else I could take down trees or get tree branches aside from finding another hack or another axe and just chopping them down. I thought maybe the saw, I mean, take a long time sawing at it, but thought there'd be a chance there. I can't really, like... No, that just... It says stop investigating, so I already have that... active. I have to try to figure out what I can do. The good news is we got to start to a campsite. The bad news is that we completely hit a spot where I'm dead in the water with it. There are more places I could go looking, uh... No, oh, actually, hang on. Maybe I can... Maybe I can make a box here. Uh, I just saw right-clicking on a spot there was carpentry, so... Maybe I can take all the crap I've got... Uh, yeah, so plank, nails, and carpentry three. Oh, okay, well, I don't have the carpentry three. So I can't even make the wood crate. Yeah, I'll have to see what I'll do in time. Like, we've got the starts here. What it'll go into, though, it'll have to be seen. But thank you guys for joining me on this episode of Project Zomboid. If you liked the video, be sure to give a like. And if you have any comments, tips, or tricks, put in the comments right down below. Until I see you all in the next video or episode, survivors, please remember, as always, to take care and stay alive.